Alright, so I'm back, and I want to build a grappling gun from the Batman. Now, I don't have much images to work off when making this grappling gun, so it may not look like what it looks like in the movie after you see the movie, but I we do have a couple of clips showing what it can do and kind of what it looks like. I, I You can barely see it. It's dark as hell. But anyways, one of the cool features in the grappling gun is that it can like just retract into his wrist, which is oof, pretty cool. I'm gonna the clip right here. Now obviously when I make this grappling gun, it's not going to be able to like lift me or a human being, but what it will be able to do is bring objects from across the room to you. It'll also let you just deal damage to things across the room and then just bring it back to you so then you can just damage another thing. So yeah, I, that, it's, it's a pretty good weapon too. But without further ado, let's get right into the build. <laughs> Alright now obviously I didn't make the tutorial easy to follow that's because the clips that like I had they didn't really explain how to build a thing so I just decided you know Home Depot music I'm gonna explain how to build everything now. Basically right here I just took cardboard and made a handle but then I ended up cutting it out just to make sure the battery can fit and I have an area to like hide the battery. Right here we just have like a pen tube with an elastic around it just so you can use it as like the launcher and then the, the binder clip is kind of just used to like um the binder clips kind of just uses like a trigger to hold it in place. Originally, I was going to use my LiPo battery, which was like 14.6 volts. And this motor can only take 6 volts. But with the 14.6 volts, this thing worked like a beast. And then anyways, it was working fine before this project. But for some reason now, it just kept breaking the button. So then I had to switch to 9 volts. And I hated it. But it works. But like not at like the strength of like the 14.6 volts. So this project is kind of like dimmed down but before that this thing would cut through like wood and, and cardboard and stuff it was crazy and to find a 9 volt battery I kind of had to like steal one from my garage and I kind of just look like a crook while I'm doing this but uh, I got the 9 volt battery though but now that I'm done explaining everything let's get right to the test footage Thank you for watching the whole video. I just want to say a big thank you to everybody who saw my retractable Spider-Man web shooter video because that got 15k views now. That's that's incredible to me. I didn't think I'd actually get at this point.